Hey guys, this is Ashish and you're watching Techometer. So guys, I have saw many problems with many PCs running on AMD facing the issue of black screen while using OBS software. So OBS software is used to record the screen or uh, to stream online. So I was also facing the same problem while using the OBS. So after many research and finding I finally find out found out that how to fix this error. So to st start with resolving this you first have to download the app which I have mentioned uh, download the app whose link I have mentioned in the description. Just go to that link download that app and that app will automatically download the required drivers or the missing drivers which are needed for your PC or laptop. The app is official AMD app which will detect your PC and its requirement and download the drivers accordingly. The problem which you are facing was due to AMD uses a switchable graphics and switchable graphics is the main re reason why we are facing this problem. But in this further video I will be telling you how to fix that error. So you can see I am already recording on OBS software. Here my OBS is running and I am using it. So after when you after installing the app which I have given in the description then right click on your desktop and click on AMD Radeon settings. Something like this will appear. Just click on preference, then click on setting. Okay, so after clicking on setting, you'll find this thing. Now, what you have to do is just click on switchable graphics. After clicking on switchable graphics, you will find something like this. As you can see, I have already OBS 64.exe running on here. But if you don't find here the OBS app, don't worry. You have just click on running application and here you'll find installed applications. So now if you don't have OBS here, just click on browse, then go to your settings local drive program files obs studio then go to bin and if you're using 32 bit you have to go here and if you're using 64 bit you have to go here as i'm using 64 bit i'll click here and click open right now i'll not be doing this because i've already done this so after going there you will see obs in this area now what you have to do is by default it is on high performance just click here and click on power saving after clicking on power saving just close this app and i recommend just to restart your pc because it is not required but i recommend just restart pc so that nothing nothing problem can be there on your pc so after that you can run your obs easily so guys that's it for this video and if you like this video do subscribe and if you like this video do give a thumbs up and if you love this video do subscribe to our channel.